So I'll just make this Okay, you are really getting good. Oh, you too. I mean, when we first started going out, you couldn't kiss at all. I mean, it's soccer. Oh, really? Absolutely. You probably already better than half the guys on my team. <laughs> probably more than half. <laughs> hmm. What do you mean I couldn't kiss at all? Don't worry. I've taught you well. I know. <laughs> Ow! Okay, but seriously, don't you think you get more playing time at a school like Michigan? Yeah, maybe, but it's always been about being a Tar Heel for me. Hey, you guys, I'm gonna up. wear that Carolina blue. Yeah, yeah, baby. Okay, what is the lacrosse team doing on our field? The school cut our team. Wait, what? Not enough girls signed up. What, so they just cut us? We can't do that. Okay, this is not over. Hi, girls. I heard the bad news. Bad? It's a disaster. Now college scouts, they won't even get to see us play. Yeah. I know. If there's anything I can do, just say the word. As a matter of fact, there is. We want to try out for the boys' team. <laughs> uh, anything besides that. Coach, come on! You know that we're good enough. I, uh, don't know that that's a thing that I know. What? All we're asking for is one shot. Come on. Girls, we have two weeks before school starts. Then we open against Illyria, a rivalry game. We have to win. And we can help you win. Hey, baby. Hey. What's going on, coach? Um, girls here I want to try out for the team. <laughs> I'm not serious. <laughs> all right, all right. You're all excellent players. Girls aren't as fast as boys. What? Or strong, or as athletic. <laughs> hey, this is not me talking. It's a scientific fact. Girls can't beat boys. It's as simple as that. Okay, well, Justin, you're the team captain. What do you think about it? I think the coach said it all. <laughs> Yesterday, you told me that I was better than half the guys on your team. What? <laughs> I never said that. What are you talking about? Why are you lying? Well, end of discussion. <laughs> Fine. End of relationship. Oh! Come on, baby, don't be like that. I, I just don't want to see you get hurt. You are so full of Back to practice.
Something <laughs> sad. Ow. Ew, it's you. God, you and your brother look scary alike from the back. I think it's your total lack of curves. Hi, Monique. It's so good to see you, too. Mm. I'm looking for Sebastian. Where is he? I don't know. Just remind your brother how lucky he is to be in my life, and tell him to give me a call if he wants to stay in it, okay? Okay. Does he have your number? 1-800-BIATCH. She will do great things. I have a surprise for you! And this is why I don't bring friends over. Mom, not now. I had a really bad this day, so I don't... This is just thing to, to just perk you up. Okay. Hold on. All right, keep your eyes closed. Okay. Eyes closed, okay. eyes closed, okay. closed, closed, closed. They're closed. All right. Surprise! Beautiful gowns for my darling debutante. Mom, have I not told you a thousand times I have no interest in being a debutante? It's totally archaic. How could I wind up with a daughter who only wants to kick a muddy ball around a field all day? Well, the world has been set right, Mom. They cut my team. What, no soccer? Yeah, that's right, no soccer. How sad. Yeah, I can see you're all torn up. Well, Justin's gonna love you in this. Yet another reason not to wear it. I dumped him. What? Why? I don't want to talk about it. He's so handsome and rugged and chiseled and great. Then why don't you date him, Mom? <laughs> hey, Sebastian. Hey. You okay? Uh-huh. Monique was looking for you. Mm. Why do you even date her anyway? She's hot. It's a guy thing. Ugh, but she's so awful. <laughs> hey, you know, you could use the front door. And Mom can't see me. She thinks I'm staying at Dad's, Dad thinks I'm staying at Mom's. In two days, they both think that I'm going away to school. That is the beauty of divorce. Wait, where are you going? London, for a couple of weeks. As in London, England? Yeah, my band got a slot in a music festival there. Okay, what are you gonna do about school? Yeah, I was kinda hoping you could help me with that. Could you just, like, pretend to be Mom, call Lyria, tell them I'm sick, something good that sounds like it would last for two weeks like Mad Cow? Sebastian, you just got kicked out of Cornwall for skipping. This is not exactly the way you want to start out. Hey, I want to be a musician, okay? Last time I heard, they don't need to know trigonometry. And besides, if you want to chase your dreams, sometimes you got to break the rules, right? You know the percentage of bands that actually make it to the big time? Probably the same as female soccer players. I will see you in two weeks. Sebastian. Ah, Sebastian! Were you just talking with your brother? No. Yes? On the phone. He's at Dad's. Bye, Dad. Picture this. We're at the country club. They call your name, and you emerge in this. Ta-da! Ugh, no. Sorry, Mom. I have a strict no ruffles policy. Sometimes I just think you just might as well be your brother. Hmm. You know what? If you can't join him, beat him. <laughs> you want me to turn you into your brother? That's right. I'm going to Elyria Sebastian. Mm -hmm. I'm going to make the boys' soccer team there. And then in 12 days, I'm going to beat the Cornwall boys' That's team. That's right. OK. You've taken way too many soccer balls to the head. You know I can do it, Paul. Yeah. Except for the voice and the mannerisms and the breasts and the mentality and. Besides, it doesn't matter. Nobody in Elyria has even met Sebastian. They wouldn't know the difference. They'll know he's a girl. Oh, come on, Paul. Yeah, yeah come, come on, Paul. Paul. Yeah, come on, Paul. Okay. Okay. I'll see what I can do. Yes. Who can turn the world on with a smile? Who can take a nothing day and suddenly make it all seem worthwhile?
No, you didn't, and you're not going. We've hardly spent any time together this summer. Now you just go upstairs and unpack. Okay, Mom, I thought about what you said, and you know that Monique is gonna be there 24 seven with Sebastian, so I don't know, I was just thinking that maybe she could show me the ropes on the whole Debbie Don thing. This is so exciting. We're gonna have so much fun. Now there's the formal ball, of course, and the luncheon, and oh, did I mention the fundraiser next week? It's gonna be a carnival. Now, your brother promised to be there, so remind him when you see him, all okay. right? Oh, my little girl. You're finally gonna be a lady. <laughs> Are you sure I can do this? Oh, yeah. Absolutely. What's up? Oh, my God, he knew. Come on, let's but go. Come on, go home. He didn't he know. He was being friendly. No, no we're not going home. Right Just this stop it. No, I did not spend idea. all this time. It's my idea. idea. You asked me. I was a good friend. I did your hair and your makeup, and that was not easy. That was not easy by your being a girl. We're not going. No, we're not going. No. He was being friendly. Now, let's run through it one more time. Let me hear the voice. <clears throat> hey, what's up? I'm Sebastian. Okay, now show me the strut. No hakalugi. <sighs> I'm so proud. <laughs> Get off me. Remember, inside every girl, there's a boy. That came out wrong, but you know what I mean. Bye. Be a good boy. I've got to, got to, got to catch my breath. I've got to, got to, got to catch my breath. I've got to, got to catch my breath. We're getting closer and closer and warmer and warmer. My heart is racing and pacing. The dance is gonna kill me. Good girl. I'm such a bad boy. It used to be a good girl. What's your name? Sebastian Hastings. Duke Corsino. Mm. Oh, um, okay. Okay. Yeah. okay. 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 Um, this is Andrew and Toby. They live next door. Yeah, freshman dorms that away, Twiglet. Seriously, how old are you? I skipped a couple grades. <laughs> I'm brilliant. Shh. Anyway. Do you know when uh, soccer tryouts start? <laughs> Noon. You play? Absolutely. Center forward. You know it, brah. So, uh, you play the beautiful game? Bro? Brothers? Brethren? <laughs> yeah, I'm a striker. Andrew and Toby are halfbacks. Sweet! Okay, well, why do you have tampons in your boot? Um... I get really bad nosebleeds. So you stick them up your nose? Yeah. What? You, you've never done that? Oh my, Beckham does it all the time. Serious? Yes. Look, I'll just show you how to do it. Ah. Take, take that off and whatever that is. And, and you stick it right in there. 
right in. It absorbs right up. <laughs> you kidding me? That's disgusting. Oh my god, your roommate's a freak. <laughs> Let's start the season out. We finished the last. Sharp! What are you, the runt of the family? Okay. Shirts and skins. <clears throat> pa pardon me, sir. I have to be a shirt. What? I'm allergic to the sun. You're allergic to the sun? Very, very, very deathly, deathly allergic. Well, we like to accommodate here at our area, so I'll follow you around with a parasol. All right, Nancy boy? You're a shirt. Okay, guys. Let's go. Select a coming in on the dance, Sister D, Mr. C. Here we go. Jump on your seat and make your body feel a bit. Hold your hands and shuffle your feet. Call the rhythm is nice tonight. Everybody have fun tonight. Move your body from side to side. Keep the rhythm and stay in time. Do the bump and wait a while. All the people don't do it. Go down, jump up. And everybody jump up. Lord, I jump up if you feeling good. Ladies, gentlemen. I've seen a lot of energy and commitment out there today. And that makes the coach proud. Now, I want to split us up into first string and second string. You second stringers, don't take it too hard. You're just as much part of this team as the first stringers. Apart from, of course, playing the game part. Shula. Hames. Potensky. Donna. Hastings. Second string. The rest of you, congratulations. First stringers. Now hit the showers. Shower time. Shower time? <laughs> Hastings, no shower for you. Okay. Principal Gold wants to see you in his office. Mm -hmm. I'm over. It's done. They know. Sebastian's file. Horatio Gold, headmaster. So very pleased to meet you. So very, very pleased. Hello, sir. Heard you, <clears throat> heard you wanted to see me. I'd like to say welcome. Welcome to Illyria. Welcome, 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 welcome to Illyria. I just wanted to have you in to say welcome. See how you're doing. <clears throat> yeah, I'm doing great, you know, just <clears throat> busy being a guy. Being a guy, yeah. Well, let's take a look at your file, Sebastian. Mm -hmm. And, uh, seems to be stuck a bit. There we go. All right. Okay. <sighs> okay, you're busted. I know you don't want to sit here and talk to the headmaster, but I'm not going to take no for an answer. Now have a sit in the headmaster's chair. Come on, have a sit. Sit it. So, Sebastian Hastings. How do you like campus? Beautiful. You being inspired? By the charcoal black and candy apple red? You know it. <laughs> hey, don't touch it, ever, ever. Do not do that. You know, Sebastian, I was a transfer student myself. Once upon a time, back when dinosaurs roamed the earth. <laughs> so I keep a special interest on the transfer students that come to this school. At 
act as a unofficial big brother. <laughs> don't be surprised if I don't just pop in unannounced from time to time, just to check up. Yeah, well, I look forward to it. <laughs> now scoot! <laughs> oh, sorry. That's oh, okay, don't worry about my it. fault. What is... Oh, getting to know the opposite sex, are we? <laughs> Male-female dynamics, all that. Sexual tension. It's all part of the high school experience. So continue, continue, please. But uh, keep it cleaned up. Okay. Abstinence is key. Abstinence is the best way to not is to not. <laughs> uh, hmm? Yeah. <laughs> is he always that friendly? <laughs> Are you kidding? That's him being rude. Huh. All right. Ooh, cute shoes. Oh, you think so? I got my anthropology. No way, they have shoes there? Oh yeah, right by the accessories. Huh. <clears throat> Here are your books. Thanks. Well, I, I guess I, you know, go take care of some guy stuff. Okay. There you go. Have a great apple and sandwich. Hi. I would love a no. but hey dudes, mind if I join? Thanks. So those soccer tryouts were bogus, huh? I mean, second string, come on, that's ridiculous. Am I right? Am I right? So the game against Cornwall, that should be interesting, huh? And why would that be interesting? Well, my sister goes there and she used to date that tool Justin Drayton. <laughs> <laughs> I know him. I made him cry once during a game. Wait. That was you? <laughs> Absolutely. That was so funny. Wow. Is your sister hot? Uh, I guess so. She's got a great personality. Ew. Yeah. Incoming! Oh, yeah. Check out the booty on that blonde. Uh-oh, don't talk about her that way. Oh, <laughs> that's your girlfriend? <laughs> he wishes. Until recently, she was dating this college guy, but he dumped her, and I hear she's a total mess right now, like really vulnerable. Confidence, self-esteem is way down. In man words, it's time to pound. Yeah, exactly. Mm. Mm. I hate that guy. Did you know baloney is 38% hoof? Thanks, Malcolm. Uh-oh, looks like you got some competition. <laughs> it's just Malcolm. Total geek. She looks so sad. It's heartbreaking. It, it just, I can relate, you know? I mean, I just got out of a bad relationship, too. And you think you know someone, and you realize it's all been a big lie. Every touch, every kiss. Plus, you know, you can never get chicks to shut up. Malcolm Festies, dorm director. Shower shoes are to be worn in the bathroom at all times except when in the actual shower. Did you not read your dorm life pamphlet? It was in your cubby. Oh! Sup, now? Yeah, okay, homie. Mm, later. Hey, you forgot uh, this, Coolio. Word, G-Money.
I don't know what to tell you about the whole soccer team. But as for the social stuff, I got an idea. You do? Yeah. We're going to show everybody the man that you really are. How are we going to do that? Go, Viola. Nice. Mm, look who's here. Fox him, Mama. Uh, 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 don't look at him. Maybe he won't see us. Yeah, spread out so it looks like we got in a room. Sup? Sup? Go Kia. Hey, sexy lady. I like your flow. Hey, Sebastian. Hey. Oh, Kia. Hey, girls. Oh. How you doing, baby? Mm. Not the same without you. I oh, know. I'm mm. sorry. New school, new baby. Yeah. Pool. I miss you, Sebastian. <laughs> I've been thinking about you a lot. Especially at night. Sweet. And late. Even better. OK, did she just say that to Sebastian? What just happened? To <laughs> Sebastian. OK, big mournful sigh. <laughs> Bittersweet farewell. Yours plaything, baby, yours plaything. Really great to see you, Sebastian. Call me anytime. Thank you, Kia. You're gorgeous. And go, Yvonne. Women. <laughs> yeah. yeah, you know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah. Sebastian, is that you? Hey, what's going on, Yvonne? OK, who's this one? Huh? I mean, our school lost its top gun, Sebastian Hastings. Well, <clears throat> time comes for a man to move along, Yvonne. I know, Sebastian. In the end, I wasn't woman enough for you. No, you weren't. And that's just something I'll always have to live with. It just hurts, that's all. Love is pain. Just know, I'll never forget you, Sebastian. Mm -hmm. Ever! Never! Need it. Okay, okay, okay. We, we might need to do a little reevaluating here. Yeah. Hey there, pretty lady. Ew. What are you, hitting on me? Um, uh, just... <laughs> okay, let me put a stop to that little brain fart right now. <laughs> Girls with asses like mine do not talk to boys with faces like yours. <laughs> I'm looking for my boyfriend, Sebastian Hastings. Have you guys seen him? <laughs> Sebastian? Not good. Don't let her get too close, she'll recognize you. What am I gonna do? Se Sebastian! Keep away from me! I beg your pardon, pretty lady. Okay, you know what? Don't come any closer, Monique. It's over. <laughs> what are you talking about? I don't want to talk to you, crazy. Sebastian, come back here. You're hot, Monique. Smoking hot. Come here. But <laughs> well, there are plenty of hot girls out there. Come back here and talk to me. And the truth is, you have absolutely nothing else to offer. And when my eyes are closed, I see you for what you truly are, which is ugly. <laughs> Especially my idol now, man. Oh, there he is. Oh, What's up, brother? Hey, 
Justine, chick won't stop dogging me, man. Oh my god. Oh, oh my god, she's in our class. Uh, Dude, quit blushing. That's lame. Shut up, I'm not blushing. Everyone, please take a slip and read off the name of your lab partner. Eunice Bates? <laughs> <laughs> you gotta be kidding me. Be nice. Yeah. She got a little something, something. Yeah, Aspen headgear. <laughs> Olivia Lennox. Oh, you know her? Talked to her for like a second. About what? She gave you the nod. Yeah, dude. she did a good one, too. Yeah, she gives good okay, nods. Could everybody please calm down? I can't believe you got her as a lab partner. Hey, switch one. Switch one. I can't. I said her name out loud. Some guys just walk in the light, you know? Hello again. Hello. I don't think we introduced ourselves before. I'm Sebastian. Olivia. I'm gonna be the best lab partner you ever had. Cool. I gotta be completely honest. The whole dissecting thing kind of freaks me out. So uh, I think you may have to take the reins on this one. Wow. Most guys would never admit that. <laughs> oh, crap. You're right. No, don't don't worry. I think it's refreshing. You do? Uh, no paper near the Bunsen burner. Okay. Oh, wait. What's this? Poems? Lyrics. They're his. My, my old stuff. Wake up. I've been waiting for you. Those are really good. So honest. I know, I keep telling him, me, me, self, my, myself. I, I write songs too, Olivia. Really, Malcolm? That's wonderful. Hey, check it out. I see you through your window. Well, I'm standing on a tree outside. You, you sit. You, go. Go. Did you say anything about me? No, was I supposed to? Come on. This, this, this is perfect. You get to spend an hour with her every other day. You can convince her to go out with me. Dude, she had that option for like three and a half years. Okay, I'll tell you what. You do this, I'll work with you on your soccer. I'll make you good enough to make first string. By the Cornwall game? Absolutely. Okay, yeah, you got a deal. You're the man. Yes, I am. Saga, 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 na, na, na. Test day, one. Push up your hand in the air like this, but wait, face to face and embrace your history. We got the recipe to erase the treachery, repping the south side of shot down to the death of me. But we pay for conveying your safe and the same. We crumble up the crew like they was paper mache. Come on, the paper we spray, making fakers the play. Power to give props, we can take it away. Yeah, you never catch me with no lame girl bones. The fish boys is deeper than James Earl Jones. Me the BD man, we run in the same world zone. Fire burn a vampire as the game twirls on. Yeah, this is the music we are putting out. John, take a look up on your watch. What? The real man of dance all return back. Hotter than that. Yeah, trash and trash. Yeah, fast, no blood, flat and fresh and hot. Anyway, this punk, that punk, neither you either. This bad man, your life is in slander. The my lyrics are burn you like ginger. Cap you like lightning, shake you like thunder. For your DJ, I don't fear. Enough of them a bad man, yes, but I don't care. Let me, you think I don't go there to half can it's a killer sound there. It 
just isn't fair, Malvolio. I wait three years for Olivia, and then some transfer student comes in, and suddenly she's acting like some obsessed, love-struck teenager. I'm not gonna take that line down, Malvolio. Yeah, I know, I know. You're absolutely right. I'll do some digging, I'll find out what it is, and I'll nip his chances with Olivia right in the bud. What is that? Oh, oh yeah, sure, a walk. Sorry, come on. You are so smart. Hello. Miss me? Yeah, what's going on? What's wrong with your voice? <clears throat> oh, I just have a little bit of a cold, so <coughs> I'm still a little too flimmy. Did you come to school? Yes, I did. It's uh, all taken care of, just make sure you're back by the 12th. It was so cool vibe. We went on a couple days early and the crowd flipped for us. They wanted an encore, so we did one of my songs acoustically. They went nuts for my lyrics. Oh, that's so cool. And you were right about Monique. She's history. Oh, she really is, isn't she? Oh, but I gotta go though, I'll talk to you later. Okay, bye. Trouble with your wig, Hastings? Uh, no, um, I actually, I have a scalp condition. <laughs> No, you don't. Yeah, um, I do. I uh, really do. It's um, really acting up. No, the... you don't. You've got male pattern baldness. Scoot over, kiddo. Now, I don't know if you've realized, but recently I've started to thin out myself. And I've tried all the creams and the butters, and I still can't seem to stop Mother Nature's vindictive fury, and neither can you. Okay, there's going to be a time when you're going to have to come out of the closet and just accept yourself for who you are, a baldy. Okay, but it's gonna be all right, okay? <laughs> oh, and between you and me, chicks, dig it. <laughs> Rouge! Hang ten. Hi, Olivia. Um, I don't want you to be worried, but Malvolio's missing. Oh, no. Yeah, uh, if you see him, don't feed him. He has an irritable bowel. Yeah, because that would be my very first instinct to feed the tarantula. <laughs> <clears throat> Been a wild idea. Have you ever thought about going out with Duke Orsino? I, I, I see that. Duke? Yeah. No. Yeah. No. Yeah. No. Yeah. No! <laughs> I mean, he's good looking and everything, but he's just not the guy for me. Hmm. I don't know. I think there may be more to him than you think there is. Okay, so you're telling me he's not just another dumb jock who wants to hook up with me so he can tell all of his friends, but... But too insecure to treat you as an equal? Exactly. Tell me about it. You know, I think you're the first guy at the school who hasn't tried anything with me. <laughs> <laughs> Trust me, you're not my type. Well, why not? <clears throat> you know, it's just... I don't think of you in that way. We're friends, you know. Mm. You're actually one of the few people here that I feel comfortable around. I feel the same way about you. Good. Then just take my advice. Go out with Duke. I'll consider it. <laughs> so, uh, what, what is that exactly? Um, I think that's the spleen. Hmm. Okay, who's your daddy? Huh? I got her to agree to consider you. You're halfway in, man. Oh, um, oh, okay. Uh, so, so should I ask her out? No. You don't want to freak her out. You got to have a casual conversation first. Hello? Why do I get the feeling you don't do this very often? Man, I just... I'm not really good at talking to girls. Why? You're hot. What? <clears throat> you know, you're an appealing guy, man. Guy, guy man. Look, I, I don't know. I just always say the wrong... I just always say the wrong thing. Okay. All right, come on. Let's get up. I want to try something where I'm going to act like a girl, and you're going to talk to me, okay? Ew, do, do I have to? Yes. Because I'm Viola. Duke, nice to meet you. Okay, that was creepy. You really just sounded like a girl just then. I used to imitate my sister all the time. I got really good at it. Come on. Get up. <laughs> come on. <laughs> Ask me some questions, and... If the chemistry's right, things will just start flowing. Hmm. Uh, um, questions about what? Anything. Ask me if I like cheese. Um, okay. Do you like cheese? Well, why, yes, I do. My favorite's Gouda. Oh, <laughs> I like Gouda, too? 
See? See what? We're flowing. We're talking about cheese. So what? Flow is flow. What? What's that? What is that? No, no, it's no, it's it's And Junior Lee? Yeah, how'd you know? So is mine. I gotta go too. Oh, but I can't deal with this right now. I have soccer to worry about. Not gonna be that bad. Olivia's gonna be there. It's a perfect opportunity for me to lay some groundwork. Oh, Olivia's gonna be there. And my sister, and Monique, and you, and my mom. Great. Hey, dude. I will cut you, man. All right, I'm gonna tell you the truth. I never really liked carnival. Hey, I work in the kissing booth. Come see me. I love carnival. <laughs> hey, dude, where are you going? Where do you think I'm going? Uh oh. What's up? Oh, nothing. Um, just my psycho ex, so I don't really want to deal with her. So if you guys don't mind, I'm gonna lay low for a little while. All right, cool. Catch you later. Okay. I see a kitten gasping for air. getting you all excited about being a debutante, huh? Super duper excited. Have a good carnival. Oh, 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 my little Petunia, where do you think you're going? You have the next shift at the kissing booth, and where's your brother? He's late for the cotton candy cart. I'm gonna go look for him. Ow, sorry. You too. Oh. Wait, do I know you? No. Excuse me. Viola. Hey, hey, hey. Where you been? I've been calling and calling. I miss you. We need to talk. We've talked, Justin. All the talking is done. <laughs> Look, I won't break up over a stupid soccer issue, okay? Can you just be a girl for five seconds, huh? For five seconds? Okay, um, first of all, it's not a stupid soccer issue, and you're a jerk. Over eight years old is allowed inside the moon bounce. But I just saw my boyfriend going there. I believe the correct term is ex boyfriend. No relationship is over until I say it is. Understand? Whatever. You're still not getting on that moon bounce. Fine. Hey! What's that? Kia, don't look. Go! Go! Come again. You gotta make it on to me. Thank you. 
where we are uh, having fun? Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think it's gonna be like? Duke, you look at me. I know it's gonna be really, really special. But she's only kissed like 350 guys at this point. I just think we need to acknowledge the moment. After four years, Duke is finally gonna fulfill his destiny. Life is good. Life is fair. Life is just. Hi, um, I'm your relief. And yet? Thank God, sweet. I, I can't catch a break. Beware of the old guy chewing gum. It's not gum. Ugh. Do I know you? No. <laughs> huh. It's just my luck. No, 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 no. I mean, I didn't, I didn't mean it like that. It's just, you know, she's, you know, no. Okay. I mean, on the, on, on the other hand, you're, you know, also. I am? Thanks, I guess. Yeah. You don't have to flirt with her first, okay, genius? You're paying for it. <laughs> Why don't you just relax? Um, um, I don't know. Maybe I should kiss you now. I, I gave that girl my ticket and I, I waited in line. Well, it's the least I can do. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay. Here I, here I go. Um, <laughs> uh, Okay, I think that was one ticket's worth. No, no, you got a little bit more. Uh, excuse me? The hotel's across the street? Viola, what the hell is this? Back in the line, buttball! Excuse me, doofus. You're making out with my girlfriend. Ex-girlfriend. Oh, you're, you're Sebastian's sister? And you're about to die. <laughs> what are you gonna do, drown me in your tears? I did not cry during that game. I had something in my eye. Okay, you know what, guys? Can we, um, just dial it down and just let's step away, okay? You know what? She's right. I'm gonna see you on the soccer field and we'll settle this all then. Okay, Duke. Or we can straighten it out right here. Where were you at today? You just disappeared. Ran into my psycho ex, had to bolt. Oh my god! Is that a... What? Oh. Yeah. <laughs> I uh, hope you don't mind. I, I kind of borrowed one of your, your... Yeah. And you're right, by the way. These things actually work. Oh my god, you're bleeding. Are you okay? Um. <clears throat> hey, suck it up! Be a man and rub some dirt in it! Okay, I'll rub some dirt on it. So... I got into it with your sister's ex. Wait, really? Why? He saw me and her kind of making out at the kissing booth. Wait, you kissed her? Yeah, man, I'm, I hope that's okay. It was for charity. Oh, no, I mean, dude, I mean, if you want to kiss her, you go right ahead and you kiss her. I mean, knock yourself out. I mean, you just you take her and then Kiss her and then kiss the crap out of her. Okay. So, <clears throat> do you like her? I don't know. Can we not talk about this? It's, I don't know if she's your sister. It's kind of weird. Oh, right, right. Just, you know, I was just thinking that if you liked her, then maybe you should ask her out. And just, I don't know, forget about Olivia? Well, I mean, speaking as a completely objective third-party outsider with absolutely no personal interest in the matter, I am not sure that you and Olivia really mesh well together, you know? I mean, but you and Viola, I mean, 
be magic. I don't know. What does your heart tell you? Huh? I mean, which one would you rather see naked? Why do you, why, why, why do you always do that? Why do you always talk about girls in such graphic terms? Huh? You know what, you, you have issues. You're a really sensitive guy, aren't you? What? No. No, it's just... I don't know, I just look, I just think that in a relationship should be more than just the physical stuff. Like, I mean, don't get me wrong, that stuff's important, but I don't know, when I'm with someone, I want to be able to talk about other stuff. Like, I don't know, serious stuff. Stuff I can't talk about, you know, with anyone else. Yeah, like, what kind of stuff? I don't know, just stuff, like, whatever stuff there is. Like, this kind of stuff? Yeah. But what I just told you is for your ears only. If you tell anyone, I'll kick your ass. Yeah, no. I got your back, man. It's cool. How's your sister? Oh. Ah, woo. Good. Why? I don't know. I kind of was thinking I might ask if she wanted to grab dinner at Cesario's tonight. You were? Really? I'd love to. What? <clears throat> I'd love to uh, give her your phone number. Hastings! <clears throat> yeah, yeah, coach. Your first string for the Cornwall game. No, I was joking, you idiot. Dude, it's a toss. <laughs> um, um, dude. <clears throat> Do you, uh, mom, mom and Scott, you? No. Isn't he cute? Duke? Yeah. No, Sebastian, he's so cool. <sighs> but he said I'm not his type. But that's impossible. You're everyone's type. Not his. I could tell you what us mere mortals would do in this situation. What? Make him jealous. So what do you do? You just pretend to like somebody else? Mm -hmm. And then use him shamelessly? Wow. So uh, you should, uh, should call Viola up. Yeah, I think I will. Hey, Duke. Sebastian. Olivia. Olivia. What are you bench pressing these days, Duke? 225. Very impressive. <laughs> Thanks. So, uh, <clears throat> so, Duke, about that call that you're gonna make? You gonna make that? Yeah, thank you. So, how many reps can you do with that 225? <laughs> like, 20, 20. 225 is more than twice what I weigh. How many reps could you do with me? 40. <laughs> <laughs> Hello. Hi, it's Viola. Uh, Sebastian told me to call you. I'd love to go to dinner. Um, yeah, wh what? Um, yeah, I, can I call you back? Because I got to change, change my, my feet. So, uh, do 
you have any plans tonight? <clears throat> oh, <laughs> my bad. What about the thing that I talked about that <laughs> you were gonna do later? What thing? I'm, I'm, I'm seeing this. Great, then it's a date. Cesario's, eight o'clock. I'll okay. see you there. Mm -hmm. Bye, Sebastian. Later. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you did it. I'm going out to Olivia. What the hell? I thought you liked Viola now. Dude, come on. You're a guy. What would you do? Hottest girl in the school came up to you and asked you on a date. Hmm? 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 Right back. Olivia? Hi. Can I, uh, can I touch you for a second? Uh, moi? Whatever for? It's about your date with Duke. Oh, I know. I'm so glad I listened to you. You're right. He's awesome. And he looked so good in those shorts. Woo! He's not a piece of meat, Olivia. He's a man, a man with feelings. And I'm a woman with feelings, and my feelings seem to match his. You know what? Speaking as a completely objective third-party observer with absolutely no personal interest in the matter, I'm not so sure that you and Duke are a good idea after all. Well, thank you for your concern. And if you're so worried, maybe you should come to Cesario's tonight, just to keep an eye on me. We could double. I bet Eunice is available. <laughs> I'm so there, it's insane. <laughs> So, do you like cheese? Hey, you two, what's going Dude, on? <laughs> you're here. Uh, with Eunice. Mind if we join? No, 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 no. Uh, here. Lady Pterodactyl. Waiter! Waiter. <laughs> I was just telling Duke how great it is to meet a real man at this school. Uh, you were? Well, I was just about to. Isn't it great to have a real man around you, Ness? Oh, yes. A real man is difficult to find. So difficult. Sebastian's with Eunice. She must be harder than I thought she was. Okay, how come when I wanted to ask how Eunice, everyone made fun of me? But now Sebastian likes her and suddenly she's cool? Screw you guys, I hate high school. You miss hands. All right, you know what? This has been real fun, but I have to go shave. Okay. Oh. Well, this has been lovely. Um, let's do it again sometime. <laughs> what? Soon. So, um, do you like cheese? More than almost any other animal byproduct. <laughs> yeah, yeah, check, please. Hey, Monique, it's Sebastian. I don't know if Viola told you I'm in London, but I'm heading home a day early. Listen, I've been thinking, and we really need to talk. Ladies! Ladies. Welcome. My name is Cheryl Lancaster, and I'm president of the Stratford Junior League and coordinator of this year's debutante season. Oh, please. Thank you. Today, we're going to go over the guidelines for a graceful, ladylike entree into society. Son of a... Hello? Hello there. Make sure she's in the back for the group photo. Thank you for joining us, Viola. Now, who's ready to come out? Kill me. <laughs> Viola, darling. Hmm. Remember, chew like you have a secret. Uh. 
Wolf. It's none of my business, but you went out with that Duke Orsino guy, right? Yeah, once. <laughs> Did you kiss him? No, why? Oh, oh no, it's nothing, but ugh. just try to postpone it as long as possible. He has this uh, <clears throat> salivary gland condition. Yeah, he doesn't really like to talk about it, but felt like I was drowning. <laughs> really? Mm. Oh my god, ew. I know. It was repulsive. Uh, but hey, every happiness to you both. Uh, no, um, actually, I don't really like Duke. Um, I have this huge thing for his roommate, Sebastian, and I was just trying to make Sebastian jealous. <sighs> oh boy. Yeah, I know it's really wrong to use a person this way, and I feel really terrible about it, but I really, really like Sebastian. <sighs> he's so handsome, and he's not the goonish kind of handsome you see in a lot of guys. He's a delicate, like even refined handsome, you know? Oh, and when, he's, when he smiles, I just can't stop looking at him. <laughs> he's just so wonderful. <sighs> you know, Olivia. <laughs> it's Olivia, right? Yeah. <laughs> I want to give you um just little advice. Okay. <laughs> enough is enough! You are weaving a really tangled web. Yeah, like really, really tangled. And, um, honey, <laughs> gotta stop, okay? So you just gotta tell everybody the truth, be very, very honest, but just let the chips fall where they may. You're right. I know. The next time I see Sebastian, I am gonna march right up to him. You march! And I'm gonna tell him how I feel. You tell yeah. him! And then I'm gonna kiss him so passionately. What? that even the people he hates will feel pleasure. <laughs> hello, Viola. Oh, this is not good. And hello to you, little home wrecker. Uh, who are you? I am Sebastian's girlfriend. Ex-girlfriend. OK, everybody's got to stop saying that. Oh, you were the one he dumped in the pizza parlor the other day. No, 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 no. He did not dump me. We're just going through a little bit of a rough patch. Oh, I heard he dumped you. He dumped you big. It was just like a big, huge dumping. You are messing with the wrong man. I'm convinced he's hiding something. Oh, nonsense, Malcolm. He may be a little lost and confused, but deep down, he's an all-American, red-blooded male, just like yourself. Mom, I will pick out my own dress. And no, I will not wear heels. Because heels are a male invention designed to make a woman's butt look smaller and to make it harder for them to run away. Malcolm. Have you ever tried to run away in high heels? No, sir. I, Not I that easy. Not that easy. <laughs>
Get your guitar, Hastings. Just do it. Just close your eyes and kiss him. <laughs> Sebastian. Wake up. I've been waiting for you to open your eyes so I can tell you that I think I'm ready. I'm ready to free fall into the unknown. I'll see you at the game tomorrow. I think I'm gonna like this school. Hey, Monique, it's Sebastian. I don't know if Viola told you I'm in London, but I'm heading home a day early. Listen, I've been thinking we really need to talk. London? Oh! Hey, brother. Dingo's just looking for me. Hello? You know, it's um, crazy how wrong you can be about a person. <laughs> it's crazy. It's just, you know, you think that they're, that they're one thing and then they turn out to be the exact opposite. Okay, what are you talking about? You're gonna sit there and act like you don't know what I'm talking about? Okay. All right. Okay. I wanted to tell you, Duke, but you have to know. I love soccer more than anything else in the world, and I had a point to prove. What? So you're telling me that you, you used me to help you with soccer, and then you, you're you going to turn around and stab me in the back? Wait, what? Now I really don't even know what you're talking you about. No, save it, man. Look, I saw you with her. With who? Told Olivia, that's who. I saw you kissing her when you got out the cab, man. Cab? What cab? We were supposed to be friends. We are friends. No, no, you don't even know the meaning of the word. Okay, no, Olivia you never don't even liked know. you, okay? She was just using you to make me jealous. But Viola, she's crazy about you, and she has been since the first moment that you kissed her. Oh, yeah? Her. I bet that's part of your little plan. Distract me so you can move in right next to Olivia. No, that is not what happened. No, you, you and your sister have a good life. Dude! The Hastings twins couldn't be more opposite. Twins? Sebastian? Sebastian? a very long night of groveling. He's not here. Take his stupid cell phone. Justine calls here every 10 seconds. This isn't Sebastian's phone. <laughs> Sebastian! Sebastian! Ew, ew. Can I help you? Viola. Allow me to introduce myself. 2003, 2004, 2005, 2006, 2007. Nice night, 2008. Hey, Eunice. Sorry about running out on our date the other night. Oh, that's okay. My intensity scares some people. Yeah. Is something wrong? I got thrown out of my room. You mean, do you need a place to sleep? I really do. The Cornwall game is tomorrow. I've never had a roommate before. Wow. Wow, you set up all my stuff. Thanks.
Okay, ladies, listen up. Where's Hastings? Ah! Unit! <clears throat> Unit! Why didn't you wake me? You looked so serene. I made breakfast, darling. What is the big emergency? I canceled my squash game for this. I don't know. All the Principal Gold said was that we were needed at Sebastian's soccer game. <laughs> Hasn't Viola said anything to you the past couple of weeks? How should I know? She's been living with you. Hasn't she? Excuse me. Oh, thank you, guys. No. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. Today, the biggest rivalry in our district is afoot. Illyria versus Cornwall. It's going to be something else, and the atmosphere is crazy. Handshake, please. All right, your call. Heads. Heads it is. We'll stay as we are. Good game, gentlemen. How's your job? Listen to me. We can do this. Today is the day the Cornwall beats Illyria. Yeah. I ain't got much to say to you. Except for who's gonna bring that blood and pain? Black and red! Yeah. This ain't gonna be no game. This is a war. Yeah! yeah. Who's gonna bring that blood and pain? Who, 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 soccer once as a young man. Or was it chess? Is uh, there a problem, Principal? Yes, unfortunately there is. But I think it's only right that Sebastian Hastings tell you himself. Sebastian? Son? Or do you have anything you'd like to say? Uh, I'm sorry I'm not a very good soccer player. I see. Well, then, please know that what I say I say with a heavy heart. <sighs> Ladies and gentlemen, esteemed alumni, uh, friends and family of Sebastian Hastings, I am grievously sad uh -oh. to inform you that Sebastian Hastings is a girl. <laughs> I'm sorry, it's for your own good. You'll thank uh, me for it someday. We'll have a good... Oh, okay, certainly, yeah. Uh, excuse me? I'm not a girl. Oh, hello. Yes. Oh, in fact, yes, he is. He's a big girl. 
<laughs> he's actually specifically his own sister Viola, who's been impersonating him for reasons which will become very clear after extensive psychoanalysis. Uh, folks, I'm a boy. I promise. Prove it. Okay. Oh, I saw it. Nice work, Paul. That's my boy. Soccer is the world's favorite sport. Th thank you, thank you. Uh, uh, no, nothing to see here. No offense. Uh, folks, please, hang on for one second. Just talk amongst yourselves for a second. Malcolm! Can you shed some light on the current situation? Not any more than has already been shed, sir. Okay, lads, listen up now. Now that we've established this boy is a boy, is it possible we can get back to our game? <laughs> yes. Oh, um, enjoy. That was a skit we... Okay, yes. Let's okay, get guys. to it, guys. Come on. Baby. Baby, baby, baby. I have missed you so much. Oh, my God, we are both so dead. We're over. Monique, done. Work, Hastings. Bench. Good work! Our time, gentlemen. girl that kissed me last night. Wait, who kissed you? What girl? Check it out. That one. Olivia? She was all over me. She kissed me and then recited my own lyrics. Bye. This may be the girl of my dreams. That's the kiss that Duke saw. Huh? Wait, are, are those real? Oh, yeah. I'm Grace Hyperns now. No. Okay, please stay hidden until the end of the game and give me my uniform back right now. <laughs> second half. Illyria zero, Cornwall zero. Nothing but a couple of goose eggs. Coach, I'm ready to play. Is that what you call it? I've seen little girls in tutus kick the ball better than you. I changed. Come on, coach, give me one more chance. All right, go. Kick. Kill! <laughs> Let's <laughs> go. 
right back in it with the goal. Shut up, man. Dude, I know you're mad at me. Don't talk to me, You man. know what? I didn't do what you did. Get out of my face. Nothing is going on with me and Olivia. When the game is over, I'll explain everything to you. But for right now, you don't have to like me, but I'm your teammate, okay? And I want to beat these guys. I have to beat these guys. Uh, fellas, if we're not disturbing you, we have a little soccer game we'd like to finish. Get back in the net, man. Oh, what? You're going to hit my fist with your face? You want to see me doing? Get out. Let's go. Dude, stop it. Come on. Get on with it, game. All right? Come on now. Armadillo's in Illyria. That goes for the rest of you. But get on and play some real football. A bunch of girls. Okay. <clears throat> the rest of you, let's get on and play some real football like a bunch of girls. All right? Suck, I, I, I mean, not, not football, it's soccer. That's what we call it in the States. Fashion. Uh -oh. Are you okay? No, Olivia, not now. Yeah, why don't you try to tell me again how there's nothing going on between you there and Olivia? There is nothing going on between me and Olivia. What about last night? I didn't lie to you, Duke. I did, but not about this. Here's the truth. I love you. Huh? I beg your pardon? What? All right, what are you... That's just a little weird. Yeah. Okay, you know what? I can't do this anymore. Everybody, I have something to tell you. I'm not Sebastian. I'm Viola. Wait, wait. You're not Viola. Yes, I am. No, I know Viola. I, I kissed Viola. You kissed me. What, <laughs> what are you talking about? I didn't, I didn't kiss you. The girls' team at Cornwall got cut, and the guys wouldn't let me go out for their team. So, I've been pretending to be my brother while he was in London for the past two weeks. Ow so I can make the team and beat Cornwall. But my brother came home early, and that's who you saw kissing Olivia, and that's who played the first half. Just because you wear a wig doesn't prove you're a girl. OK, then. There it is. Oh, merciful Jesus. Is it just me, or does this soccer game have more nudity than most? All right, so everybody understand? Yeah, I get it. OK. Wait a minute. If I kissed your brother, where is he? <laughs> He's probably halfway to China by now. He showed his Willis and Doodleberry. So Present. Oh, hi. What the? Hey. OK, th this is freaking me out. <clears throat> uh, ladies and gentlemen, I hate to say I told you so, but I just, ow. See, Duke, I didn't betray you. I'm sorry. This isn't how I wanted it to happen, and I didn't want to hurt you, but I just wanted to prove that I was good enough. All I'm asking for is a chance. Two. It's just like what Coach says before every game. Be not afraid of greatness. Some are born great, some achieve greatness, and some have greatness thrust upon them. I think the best chance for us to be great here today is to have you play. Yeah. 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 No! No! Playing! You have to forfeit. There's no girls in this league. Here, look in the manual. What manual? Listen, pal. You and I live here. We don't discriminate based on gender. All right. That's going to bruise. Fine. You really think you can beat us with a girl on your team? <laughs> this should be fun. Go. I get to say the last word, not you. Go. OK, team. Let's go kick. Go!
To you all folks, this is a real nail biter. It's a tie score at the bottom of the second half. I know you're gonna kick it there. When your head, when your head, you see the goal, it's getting smaller. I'm getting big. Concentrate. Don't kick like a girl. I'm in your head. <laughs> was uh, here pretending to be you. Where were you? Oh, he was, um, I, actually... I was in London, playing my music. London? London? It was important to me. Now, well, you wait, should know, you should call you before you go overseas. What is it responsible? Why don't we go to dinner? As a family? Maybe tomorrow? Suppose I could fit that in. Um, would you like to have my cell phone number? Let me give you my email. Oh. <laughs> Yay! Oh, Good job. Thank you. Oh, wait, there's somebody I want you to officially meet. Sebastian Hastings, Olivia Lennox. <laughs> Very nice to meet you. Thank you. So, uh... Eunice? Toby? I have something to say. I think you are... amazing. And I'm not ashamed of it. I know tricks. Oh, Eunice. Stratford Junior League invites you to the 38th Annual Debutante Ball. 
He still could show you. You didn't see his face. I found the perfect dress. Aw, thanks, Mom. But I don't think I'm gonna get a chance to wear it. Nonsense. You don't need a man to wear a beautiful dress. But it doesn't hurt. Viola Hastings, it would be my honor to escort you tonight. Thanks, Paul. That's really sweet. Caterpillars! Caterpillars, my precious caterpillars. In 20 minutes, you'll all be beautiful butterflies. Caterpillars! Caterpillars! caterpillars. <laughs> you look beautiful. I just, I gotta get some air. think you'd show up. It really means a lot to me that you're here. Say something. I gotta turn the sprinklers on. Sorry. Hi. Hi. So what brings you here? Well, a few days ago, I kissed this girl at a kissing booth. And now, I just can't seem to stop thinking about it. Neither can she. Plus, I miss my roommate. <laughs> I really liked him. Well, he's right in here. Listen. I know I should have told you who I was, but I was afraid. Sorry. Well, you know, maybe if I'd have known you were a girl, we wouldn't have talked like we did and got to know each other the same way. And that would have been a shame. Just so you know, everything you told me when I was a guy just made me like you so much more as a girl. Okay, but just from here on in, everything would just be a lot easier if you stayed a girl. <laughs> I promise. Monique Valentine, escorted by Justin Drayton. <laughs> Shaking cold, these hands are meant to hold. Thank you, man. With all you gotta keep it strong. Move along, move along, like I know you do. And even when your hope is gone, move along, move along, just to make it through. Move along. Move along. Lost your soul. 
you gotta keep it strong Move along, move along like I know you do And even when your hope is gone Move along, move along Just a 